kami maganda sini ngayon. Ano ba yun? Yung... Sini yung ano yung guitar san? Ano pangalan niya? Yung... Yung naging ano siya, yung bida siya sa Tarzan noon. Di ba, alam ko may pelikula siya ngayon eh. Oo, yan. Tapos yung isa pa, kung gusto niya ng local, yung ki, ano? <laughs> Di ba? Para next meeting, yun na i-discuss natin. Dapat manood kayo yung isang sining ngayong gabi. Okay. We now go to contracts. And remember, class, that's, that contract is one of the sources of an obligation. So for the meantime, I'm not asking you to forget what we have discussed this morning and yesterday, but you just simply reserve the provisions that we have discussed because later on, the provisions on obligations will have to be applied to contracts. Specifically, when we talk about the last stage of a contract. Okay? So, I think we have to start with the definition of terms. And this is something to do with what a contract is. So, take note of Article 1305. And in that definition, three important things appear. Number one, contract refers to a meeting of the minds. Although, of course, that meeting of the minds cannot be literal. <laughs> Nag-uumpugan kayo ng ulo. <laughs> diba? Meeting of the minds. Second, whereby one of the parties or both of them would bind themselves. And then third, what is, what does one uh, bound himself to do? It's either to give, or to render service. Now, if you will notice, the third component of the definition of what a contract is will now connect you to the definition of an obligation. Juridical necessity to give, to do, or not to do. So that prestation to give, to do, or not to do is what the parties in the contract, promise to render or to perform to each other. And it appears in the definition of what the contract is under 1305. To give or to render some service. Okay? Now, of course, contract does not exist immediately between the parties. So, there is such a thing as stages in the formation of a contract. Class, probably it would be better for a um, an actual appreciation of these stages and which I always tell my students in class in Oblicon. You analyze what do you usually do, for example, if you want to take a jeepney. Or, if you want to buy a burger. Diba? Pag nasa kali ka at sasakay ka ng jeep, hindi yung una mong makita ang jeep, aakyat ka na. Just to make sure that you are entering into a contract of common carrier. Ano yung mga minsan tinitignan natin, especially yung ladies, di ba? Minsan, pag nakita mo, pumarada yung jeep ni driver, kung yung mukha ng mama, nakakatakot, hindi mo sa <laughs> Kung kontrabita natin. <laughs> Although that is not an essential element of a contract of common carrier. O kaya, titignan mo sa taxi, uh, ano ba tong taxi na to? Baka mamaya ako pa magtulak, last pag naman yung taxi or ano. But of course, going back to the jeepney, you have to find out where is its destination. Po, pwede ba sumampa ka lang sa jeep? <laughs> Hindi mo alam kung sa kadadari. Malay mo, pagdating, ano, ma, paggising mo, wala ka pala sa San Sebastian, napunta ka sa Baklaran, o napunta ka sa Imus Cavite. ba? So, all of these things, although you're just standing there in the road, looking at 
the jeepneys passing in front of you. You are in what stage of a contract of common carrier? That is the preparation stage, preparatory stage Of course, in the preparatory stage, that is where the offer comes into uh, play. And where is the offer there? In so far as the jeepney is concerned. Diba? Sometimes without you asking or calling the attention of the jeepney driver, all of a sudden, here is a jeepney driver stopping his jeepney in front of you. So there is an offer. That act itself of the jeepney driver stopping his jeepney in front of you, that is an offer on the part of the jeepney driver. But is it a definite offer? Meron ka bang nakitang public vehicle na walang nakarato lang nakasulat? Hindi ba wala? Lahat ng, 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 ng jeepney dito, kahit na sa probinsya, may makikita ka. Especially if you go to Cebu because... When I uh, gave a lecture in Cebu, I, I always appreciate their jeepneys because they have this color coding. Tinanong ko, para saan yung color? Sabi nung ano, kasi hoyaan mag indicate sa inyo saan ang destinasyon. Which in civil law, in contracts, that has a significance. Diba? So pag green ka, hindi ka gibo. <laughs> <laughs> Doon ka pupunta sa ano. O pag orange ka, ito pupuntahan mo. Pag dito ka naman sa Manila, although walang color coding, ano yung bakit natin masasabing, uy, yung offer ng ano, kompleto. Kasi may makikita ka, di ba, aside from the sign, sa gilid, sa harap mismo, nakalagay doon, sandadaan yung jeep. And as I've said, in so far as our code is concerned, that is very significant because that forms part of the first stage, preparatory stage. I always go back to marriage because marriage is a contract, although it is a special contract. To those who are already married, don't tell me that at the, during the first time, when you saw your spouse, nagkatitigang kayo, love at first sight, tumibok ang puso mo, uy, eto na, magpakasama tayo. <laughs> Ganun na lang ba yun? Isn't it there is such a thing as a courtship period? And that period of courtship is preparatory stage. Malay nyo, mangyari sa inyo yan ngayon. During the review, okay, may naispatan ka na rito, tatabihan mo na, araw-araw, gusto mo mag, gusto mo ng notes, umisama sa gusto mo ng notes. <laughs> Uy, gusto mo tulungan kita, magdadigest ako. Yung mga ganyang, ano, preparatory stage. <laughs> Di ba? Now, Ganon din, pagpupunta ka sa Jollibee, hindi bigla mo sasabihin doon sa ano, gusto ko ng, jo ng hamburger na to. Or if you will be entering into a restaurant and you want to take something, meron bang nagsabi sa inyo, sige, just serve me whatever food you have. What do you usually do? You ask for the menu. And take note class. Right now, I think it's already uniform among restaurants. They do not just give you a menu wherein only the name of the food is listed. ba? Anong klase ang menu ngayon na nakikita niyo sa lahat ng restaurant? Ito ang picture, ito ang pangalan. Kung sa Chinese restaurant ka, mayroong pang subtitle, kung magas pelikula, <laughs> may English translation. Tapos nakalagay sa kanan, ano, small, medium, large. Hindi size ng bewang yon na <laughs> sa is ng serving. At under that, ano yung nakalagay? Ano yung presyo? Again, that has a significance. That is an offer. So the moment that you just tell the waiter, I want this, hindi mo na ano, tuturo mo na lang yung picture, gusto ko nito. Then you're entering into the second stage. Stage of 
perfection. Which is the same thing in courtship, di ba? Pag nililigawan ka, kunyari mga babae, no, pakipot pa. Hayaan mo magdusa muna. Tapusin mo yung review ng bar exam para haro araw libre ka sa pamasahe. <laughs> Tapos pagdating ng last day at nag-propose sa'yo, okay, pag tinanggap mo yung proposal, then, nandun na ba yung perfection? Hindi pa rin, di ba? Because, Marriage is a special contract, and being a special contract, the stage of perfection in the contract of marriage takes place when the parties personally appear in front of the solemnizing officer and they exchange I do's. I think regardless of what religion you have, whether the celebration is canonical or whether it follows the Muslim rite or the Protestant, right, or Iglesia ni Cristo, there's always that portion. You are being asked by the solemnizing officer, are you willing to take this girl as your wife and this guy as your husband? Because that is the turning point in a contract of marriage. The moment that there is an I do, then... You are entering into the second stage of the contract of marriage. That is perfection. Kahit sa harapan ka ng mayor ikasal o kaya sa harapan ng west. Saan ka nakakita ng contract of marriage, justice na nagkakasal, tapos ang may ano yung gay belt pinapalo o oh, kaya natin mapapanoin kang ano. Hindi ba hindi? Ang turning point pa rin, tinatanggap mo ba to bilang yung asawa? Perfection stage. Now, ganun din sa common carrier. Diba? Pag nakita mo, uy, eto na pala, going to ano, kaya po, ano gagawin mo? Mama, hinto ho. Sasakay ka. And the moment that you board the jeepney, you're entering into the second stage of the contract of common carrier, which is perfection. 